This is a 32-year-old male with a history of long-standing seizures localizing to the inferior right temporal region on EEG. Images demonstrate herniation of the inferior right temporal lobe tissue within a somewhat tethered and distorted appearance into the skull base on the right at the level of the foramen ovale. The findings are depicted better on the anatomic T1-weighted images, with the fluid-sensitive T2-weighted images demonstrating continuity of the cortical gray matter through the osseous defect. These images depict an inferior right temporal encephalocele. Encephalocele should be distinguished from meningocele's, which the lesion contains only meninges herniating through a dural and skull defect. Encephalocele's occur once out of every 4,000 live births. Clinical presentation may range from an apparent subcutaneous mass at birth, while skull-based encephalocele's may present as a lump or bump in the oropharynx or nasopharynx. The lesions are thought to be secondary to failure of closure of the rostral end and the neural tube in early development. Most cases are sporadic. The tissue extending through the osseous defect is typically dysplastic and may be a source of recurrent seizures. Treatment is with resection of the dysplastic tissue and duroplasty at the osseous and neural defect.